Hey guys, on today's video, we're looking at your Finder right here on your Mac. So, I got a lot of questions about how to quit Finder on your Mac. Well, you can't technically quit Finder, however, you can relaunch it or refresh it. The thing is, Finder isn't just another app on your Mac. So, for example, here's Safari, I can just go ahead and quit Safari, right? Pressing Command Q. However, Finder doesn't work that way because Finder is part of your system, kind of. So, that's why we can't just quit it. What we can do if it becomes frozen for any reason, because that could happen to Finder, sure, why not? We can go on the top, the left side of your screen. Here, you're gonna have Finder. And then right beside it, there's the Apple logo. We're just gonna click on that Apple logo. And then if you go down, you're gonna see Force Quit. So if you're really stuck and you want to refresh Finder, which we have to do sometimes, here we go. Just click on Force Quit. Once you do that, you will see this window right here which will give you all the apps that you have currently open. So, same deal. If you have any of these apps that are stuck, you can force quit them. And yes, it's safe to force quit, including Finder. I'm actually gonna force quit Finder right now. So we're gonna go ahead and relaunch Finder. For the other ones, you will see that their option changes to force quit, and with Finder, it changes to relaunch. Not again, because it's not just an app. It is something different. So we're gonna go ahead and relaunch. And then you will see this message. So yes, if you're working on a project or something like that, then yes, by doing this refresh, uh, if you don't have that project saved, so if you're editing a video or maybe you're working on a Word document but you never saved it, you should not do this just in case something happens. So you don't want to do this if you haven't saved something. Right now we're just going to go ahead and relaunch and that's it. You might have noticed that nothing else happened and that's because it just refreshed really fast. All my other programs are still here. Let me just close this for now. I'm gonna zoom out. And for example, Final Cut Pro, that's something I had open with a project right here, which is fine. Uh, don't worry about the missing file thing. That's just because I moved the file somewhere else. But anyways, if you were working on something, it's still gonna be there. But although I still have my project there, nothing happened, I would still not do this if I didn't save something, unless I really have to and I'm really stuck. Now with older Macs, the refreshing thing wouldn't be as fast as newer Macs. Anyways, that would be it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.